In this tutorial, we're going to use my favorite tool, um, and it's called the Tweak tool. And if you can read there what it says, it says distort or skew part by moving face or edge of a solid. So let's click on it. Let's go tweak. Click on that face. How about you can notice that the actual interface we get is similar to the move and rotate tool. So let's we know how to use move and ro rotate tool. So let's see what happens. Well, you can see that you can actually skew your shape. You can then tilt it to one side or the other side. Let's see what happens there. Rotate and you almost twist in it. So let's orbit around this. And you can see what we create. It's almost like an abstract, you know, um, form, architectural form that something that Frank Gehry would do. Um, and we just started off with a simple rectangular um, prism and now we've turned it into something completely different. Um, so I could have fun with hours with this. Um, I encourage you to do the same. Um, I'll show you the same thing on the cylinder. So I can go up, modify, tweak, click on a face, you can move it up or down. I want to rotate it and I want to push it out. You can see that some of the rotation points don't do anything at all. It's just a matter of having a play. Notice that if you go too harsh, it will say you have an error at the top says invalid operation. So you just got to be, you know, just gentle with it, with it and just push it as far as you think it will let you go. Um, but there, I'm quite happy with that. So I had a cylinder there to begin with and now I've got a, just a completely organic, uh, it's a cylinder that looks like it's been cut on a, on a diagonal. So um, the tweak tool, um, at the top, modify, tweak, um, grab yourself a couple of primitives and just see you know what type of tweaking you can do and how crazy you can get with it. Um, it's a lot of fun. Try it out for yourself. See how you go.